Jared, thank you. Well, you know, the Ebola fight doesn't stop in Dallas. Local hospitals are amping up their security measures as well. KX HD news reporter Tashara Parker joins us in studio with the latest. And Tashara, it sounds like doctors will be asking a few more questions in the emergency room. Amanda Luke, that's right. Doctors at St. Joseph Medical Center are stepping up their efforts to protect patients and emergency room visitors. We stopped by St. Joseph's emergency room today. The, the questions nurses are asking patients is a little different than what we've heard before. Based on your symptoms, the first question could be, have you visited any West African regions? Your answer may determine whether or not you are immediately placed in one of St. Joseph's isolation rooms. Doctors tell us although Ebola is a top priority, the steps they are taking are nothing new when it comes to dealing with infectious diseases. We do that on an ongoing basis because we see infectious diseases all the time. Uh, and these precautionary measures are not unique to Ebola. They're similar to other kinds of infectious diseases. So we're constantly training. We do competency training with our staff all the time for these things. Lewis says they are taking Ebola very serious and will continue to take the appropriate steps to ensure everyone's safety. Tonight at 10, we'll take a look at one woman's journey from Sierra Leone and how her family is affected by the deadly disease. Luke.